BBC in Birmingham. It's day three of Crufts. It has been more packed than I can ever remember it all around the rings, on the benches, through the shops as well. It's the biggest and best event in the canine cosmos, supported by Pedigree. Tomorrow, of course, it's the big finale of Crufts 2007, best in show. Tonight, of course, two more dogs will be joining that stellar lineup, this time from the Hounds and Terriers. Ooh. <laughs> and we've got a representative of each. This is Sergeant, who's an otter hound. Now, otter hounds are one of the most vulnerable breeds in the country. There are only 51 puppies born last year, which really does put them in danger of extinction. They're lovely dogs, though, and you can... You need a big house, you need a big sofa, and they need to have plenty of exercise and big fences. And this, got... this very noisy boy, come on, Mr. Darcy. This is a Celian Terrier, another endangered um, breed. This, uh, Mr. Darcy's three years old, it's very noisy. Right, good, good boy, fine. good boy. But um, I'll tell you what, why don't, we let you, why don't we let you go off and have a little explore? Yeah. I don't think he really liked me very much. Um, but you've actually been uh, doing a series for Radio 4 on this, I have, you? about vulnerable breeds, and features both the Celian Terrier and the Otter Hand. And those going out at 2.45 on Sunday. Oh, Sergeant, you can go in just a second. But first of all, we're going to focus on terriers. Now, the word terrier comes from the Latin terra, which means earth, doesn't mean fear. So literally, it means earth dogs. And you'll find out why. This group has produced more Crufts champions than virtually any other group. And Matt has been right in the thick of them. 